What is up everyone? Welcome to today's reaction video and today's reaction is the very special monthly request of my incredible Patreon follower Karen. Karen, thank you so, so much for all of the support that you give me, uh, not just for subscribing to the, the YouTube and being a Patreon, but also for being one of our moderators over on the Patreon Discord and right here in our uh, daily live chats. Uh, it means the absolute world to me to have your support and have you looking out for the herd the way that you do. So thank you so, so much for that. And thank you for your request this month because I love any chance I get to check out more of Riley and Mackenzie's work, some more of The Hound and The Fox because they are incredible with every single one of their songs that I've heard. And this one is extra special because Karen has let me know that uh, there's a whole bunch of people listed in the description of their video uh, who are featured in this track or like in the, in the mix of this track, adding bonus vocals. And some of those people are not only Adam Chance, from Home Free, but also his gorgeous wife, Sammy, who I've never heard before. So I don't know how predominantly uh, they, they are gonna be featured because it just says that they're bonus vocals. So even if they are featured, I doubt it's gonna come up their name on the screen. So I probably won't be able to pick out people's individual voices because I've never heard Sammy before. But either way, I'm super excited to see what this song is and what uh, The Hound and The Fox have done here because it's an original song of theirs. It's called Wicked Women. And that just, that just excites me. That just says it's going to be something very, very cool. So uh, we're going to get into this. As always, please check out the original video linked in the description below. Give it a like, give it a comment, subscribe to Fox and Hound if you haven't already. And we're going to get into this. This is Wicked, Wo Wicked Women by Hound and Fox. Let's go. Made from a star, born from a flame, given her father's name. All right, first of all, um, having any time, any time we have Riley and McKenzie singing together at the exact same moment, it's so special. Their voices just work so perfectly together. And the beat of this straight away, the da 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 da, da I love it. Uh, then it comes in with those, those vocalizations, which I'm guessing are the bonus vocals that were said about. And the fact that they've gotten other people, I don't know where those vocals are going to go because we're 15 seconds in, but the fact that they've gotten other people to do those rather than just layering themselves a bunch of times, I think it's going to end up being something really special as this song goes on. So let's keep going. Father's name. Forced to be tamed, magic within, told in a power of sin. Okay. No way to win when you go mad. She gave it all that she had it all. The little vocalization there after she, uh, she gave it all that she had, the O vocalization that uh, Mackenzie does is just gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. But these lyrics are all like, damn. She's a, she's a woman born with magic and she's had to hold it in her whole life and been treated like crap for her her whole life. Yo, this is how you make a witch. Don't do that. She gave it all that she had it all. Passes the flame, infamous name, after a punish and shame. We are the daughters of the wicked women. The ones who are down, but they won't. I'm sorry, what was that? That was awesome. I was already like, ooh, I like the way, and then it went, dum dum. Dum, dum, oh, that that hit so different. Like I already loved it when it went into this chorus, and then the boom 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 moment was sick. We are the daughters of the wicked women, the ones who went down, but they wanted to break us, take us to ashes on the ground. We won't burn in the fire. We just get bright. Oh, I love that chorus. Yo, that chorus is fire. The ones who wouldn't drown. The ways you kill witches are burning them at the stake and uh, tying the rock to them to test if they're really witches. That was the test. So the fact that they're the ones that wouldn't drown, the ones that actually, we're, we're, we're the daughters of the real witches here uh, and the ones who wouldn't burn because we just shine brighter. Freaking 
Love that so much. These lyrics are absolutely fire and your they they sound incredible singing them. And I love that the verses, the the verse, the first verse, like I said, it was Riley and McKenzie singing it together. Then you get to that chorus and it's just her, just the strong female voice coming through. I love that so much. And wicked women never die. Meant to go far, told to be still. Men are afraid of her will. They hunt for the thrill, but she is the evil one who died on that hill. They couldn't kill the ripples she made. They couldn't bend. I feel like this is another, Oh, I feel like they're going through different, powerful, impressive women or stories about women from history that, you know, have been, you know, a, a powerful woman is persecuted by men. Uh, I feel like that's what they're doing. I don't know this one here that they're talking about. I can't put my finger on what it is, but this whole, they're, they're talking about someone very specific here and the animatics are showing it with, the way that she is up on the hill and there's a particular kind of soldier up behind her. And I'm sure that people who are more history buffs than me will probably be able to pick out what this is right away. But she's up, she's up on a hill with arrows sticking out of her back and then she's falling into the water and the line about that they, they couldn't, they couldn't stop the ripples. They couldn't stop the waves. I love that, that ripple effect going forward that she's remembered. She's inspiring women today and she's making more like her. And you did that freaking love that. The one who died on that hill They couldn't kill the ripples she made They couldn't bend her life The other daughters are the wicked women The ones who wouldn't drown But they wanted to break us Take us to ashes on the ground This animatic, by the way, is absolutely fire because again, I ain't no history buff. It's not a strong point of mine. Okay. I caught the witch's reference right away, which has burnt the stake. You got me. I know that one right away, but there have been some other ones in here that I haven't known. And a lot of those, like I could look at a lot of those women that were there and drawn in the animatic. And I was like, ah, I know these are drawings of famous historical figures ones that have been done wrong. And I'm pretty sure I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure one of them was Joan of Arc, but I might be wrong there. But either way, I, I know I, I know enough that my brain can pull that, look at these pictures and go, ah, they look familiar. And knowing the theme of the song, I imagine that's what it is. Uh, let me know in the comments who these women are. Uh, but yeah, I, I, again, I'm not a history buff, but you know the theme of the song. And I love that in the animatic, at least, they have drawn like, the, the song so clearly lays out what it is. And they're like, no, I want actual pictures of these women. I want to draw my own versions of these women so that it, you're reminded of who they are. I love that. Yo, give me a history lesson in the comics. I wouldn't, I, in the comments, I want to know so badly. But this part here where it's come in now, it's been all about the wicked women and like, you're not going to stop us. Suddenly we have a whole bunch of feet marching and this deep masculine male woe sound is coming in. And then it pans up and I'm seeing either torches or like guns or something there. So I'm not sure what's going to go on here. Yo, I, I got into it and I was expecting it and then it wasn't there. I was ready for the bump up, bump up and it wasn't there this time. And they saved it for the 
Next part. I like that. What a freaking song. Yo. That was absolutely incredible. Even this nice, nice little outro. Because the thing I didn't comment on through that, the way the music was done, that was phenomenal as well. Because taking aside how good the lyrics were, like I said, that beat on the Wicked Women, Thing, the way the drums were done there, but then the rest of the song just being kind of this simple guitar thing just works so damn well. Uh, but oh my God, this was fire. This was incredible. And it's such a great song. Like if I had daughters, this would be the song the kind of songs I want them growing up listening to. I would want them growing up like, yo, you, you, you are the descendants of these kind of women. You, you need to know this. And the fact that it, for a guy like me, for someone like me who doesn't immediately know this and like, didn't pay a whole lot of attention in school. Let's be real. Uh, to, it, it makes me sit here now and go, who are these other women in this film clip? I want to know who it was that this artist has picked out and chosen to feature in the clip. Uh, because yo, they're, they're, you, we, you know, even, even as someone who knows very little about history, there has been situation after situation and case after case of strong, powerful, intelligent women who, you know, should have changed the world that have been held down because their gender is the wrong gender at, for the time. And it, it's, it's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. Everything that happened with burning of witches and stuff like that was monstrous. Uh, so I would love to, again, in the comments, let me know who some of the women that were featured on the screen there were, because it, I, I'm so interested to find out, but damn Fox and the Hound, not only did amazing vocals on this, but wrote an incredible song with such a awesome theme to it. They are just absolutely incredible. I love this so, so much. Guys, please jump in the link in the description below. Give the original a like and a comment and subscribe to Fox and the Hound. If you know any little girls, show it to a little girl so that they can know that they are descended from a wicked woman as well. Uh, and yeah, leave a like and a comment on this video and subscribe. It helps out the channel so, so much and it means the absolute world to me. And check me out over on Patreon where I run weekly polls for the reactions that I do here on the channel. I also do weekly TV show reactions, a monthly movie reaction, a monthly live stream. And at the highest tier, you can get a guaranteed reaction right here on the channel. So check all that out over on Patreon. I will see you all in the next reaction video. Have a great day, night, morning, evening, afternoon, whatever time zone you're in. And I'll see you next time. Bye.